What's up everybody, Keith D here. We're out at NADA recording in beautiful Montgomery, New York, making the new Arctic Sleep album. So I figured it would be fun to take you into the live room where Nick is recording drums today and check out what equipment is using on the album. <laughs> so tell us about the drum set that is being used today. These are made by me. I've been building drums for a long time and I made this kit recently out of bird's eye maple. It's a 13 inch tom, a 16 inch floor tom, and a 24 inch bass drum. And a uh, really heavy brass snare drum. That thing weighs about 40 pounds. It's a bitch to move, but it sounds better than anything I've ever played. What's the type of sound you're going for with the with this setup? Uh, well, I'd like to rip heads off, but I'd like people to enjoy having their heads ripped off. And I think that's the general vibe of this drum set. So run us through the symbols that you're using on the recording here. Everything I I use is Minel. These are the Bison's traditional series. It's just the uh, symbols I found are the most durable and the most musical sounding. I've broken a lot of symbols in my life and these just seem to hold up and sound really good while doing it. So I've got 15 inch hi-hats, a 19 inch medium thin crash, a 20 inch medium crash. This is a 23 inch heavy ride. And then I don't often use a China symbol, but for this album, it kind of had to be there. So. The Sabian Cheapo B8 Pro seems to be one of the best sounding China symbols out there. People spend hundreds of dollars on China symbols, but I find a China symbol needs to be trashy. So you can get a cheap one and it sounds great. This one's lasted for years and it sounds awesome. So that's that. DW double pedal, kind of your standard 5,000 workhorse and Iron Cobra hi-hat stand. All the other hardware is DW, symbol stands. What's in the mug? The mug is coffee. Much needed for recording session that starts at 10 a.m. Even though our songs are slow, I still need caffeine to is this the furthest away recording you've ever done? It is. I don't think I've ever traveled out of state to record. I don't know, I, ha I have, but not this far. I've traveled one state from uh, Illinois to Wisconsin to record the previous Arctic Sleep albums. Yeah, so I've been building drums a good part of my life and this set I used the stave construction of building the shelves so it's a lot of vertical slats combined and makes a circle and you make it smooth um, with the bird's eye maple and I did all the inlays and everything so this is kind of my masterpiece right now. Every, every time I build a kid, it's like, I want to take it up a notch. 